Catholic Daily Mass Readings, November 18, 2022, Friday of the 33rd week in Ordinary Time. A reading from the Book of Revelation. I, John, heard a voice from heaven speak to me. Then the voice spoke to me and said, Go, take the scroll that lies open in the hand of the angel who is standing on the sea and on the land. So I went up to the angel and told him to give me the small scroll. He said to me, Take and swallow it. It will turn your stomach sour, but in your mouth it will taste as sweet as honey. I took the small scroll from angel's hand and swallowed it. In my mouth, it was like sweet honey, but when I had eaten it, my stomach turned sour. Then someone said to me, You must prophesy again about many peoples, nations, tongues, and kings. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsar song, let our response be. How sweet to my taste is your promise. In the way of your decrees, I rejoice, as much as in all riches. How sweet to my taste is your promise. Yes, your decrees are my delight. They are my counselors. How sweet to my taste is your promise. The law of your mouth is to me more precious than thousands of gold and silver pieces. How sweet to my taste is your promise. How sweet to my palate are your promises, sweeter than honey to my mouth. How sweet to my taste is your promise. Your decrees are my inheritance forever. The joy of my heart they are. How sweet to my taste is your promise. I gasp with open mouth in my yearning for your commands. How sweet to my taste is your promise. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Jesus entered the temple area and proceeded to drive out those who were selling things, saying to them, It is written, My house shall be a house of prayer, but you have made it a den of thieves. And every day he was teaching in the temple area. The chief priests, the scribes, and the leaders of the people, meanwhile, were seeking to put him to death but they could find no way to accomplish their purpose because all the people were hanging on his words. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ.